Uh, Ed, just arrived in Perth, mate. A little bit of a different feeling making your debut here. How's the feelings upon your arrival? Yeah, feeling good to finally get over here. I think it was a long flight and um, been pretty exciting 24 hours. But yeah, we're really looking forward to getting over here and now I can start to think about the game and go have some dinner and relax tonight. Just tell us how you found out the news yesterday, mate. Yeah, so after training, Brad, it was pretty low key. Brad just came up to me and, and shook my hand and said, Ed, we're going to bring you in this week. Um, so for me, I think it's good that it's been low key and it's almost good that it's over here and I can really just focus on my footy and there's not too many distractions. So yeah, as I said, I'm just looking forward to getting into it tomorrow. Was it a bit of a weird feeling when he told you? How were you feeling? Yeah, I think you, you kind of guess a little bit, but I've been around the mark a few times, so I tried not to um, almost make myself too nervous. So yeah, I think it was just a bit of relief at first, but then once it sunk in, I um, started to get pretty excited and, and telling the folks and the family they were excited for me too. It's been a couple of years for you, you drafted in 2014, it's been a pretty long wait, this obviously means a lot for you. Yeah, exactly right, like been around the club a while and um, had some setbacks but, but now I can finally start doing what I'm here to do and that's being an AFL player and contributing to the club on the field so yeah that's first and foremost the main thing, I think I know what role I need to play for the team and, and um, the, the playing group and the coaches believe in me so um, yeah I feel like um, yeah, good chance to earn some respect and, and pay back the club for having the belief in me thus far. You've had a pretty unique situation in that you've warmed up a couple of times for games. Um, I imagine you're pleased that you're actually going to be able to get out there and you know you're going to line up tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. so I think last year and this year, um, obviously warming up before the games, a lot of emotions running through, so hopefully I've had a lot of those nervous emotions before and, and when that comes tomorrow I'll be, be used to it. And yeah, I think it's good to have the, the normal preparation and, and have the family there, so it means a lot to a lot of people, not just me. So. Yeah, looking forward to getting out there. And how much did you take from your Werribee form? You played really well in particular last week. How much did you take from that confidence-wise? Yeah, a lot. I think Werribee's been great for me and a great building block for me. And I've been able to work on a lot of things that will hold me in good stead out there and um, against, against some of the best players in the league. So, yeah, I think Werribee's been great and a great building block. But, um, yeah, as I said, now it's, it's all about the AFL and playing my role for the team out there. All the best for tomorrow, Ed. Great. Thank you very much.